make sure you stand tuned in when you hear that first sign guys you know that double lock actuator will go bad soon hey guys welcome back to auto repair guys thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel today will be super helpful video to any of you having a car it could be almost any modern car and if you want to know what are the symptoms of bad double lock actuator guys we're talking about a car usually with a remote control that you can lock and unlock your vehicle stay with us we'll explain guys the first symptoms what first start going out and how to recognize that the door lock actuator will fail soon all that will be covered in this video today before we start let me just tell you a little bit about us guys every single car we get here at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos on bmws we'll have more than one thousand videos why we do all that because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can all we need guys in return please subscribe to the channel like the video that way we can keep making these absolutely free videos you can see we got another one to work on here recently as well if you need to buy any parts tools for your bmw or any car check out the link in the description of the video below that's where we get all our two supplies from and you can save a fortune so let's start on it now so we will demonstrate on that bmw guys here but uh, most of the new vehicles nowadays anything practically made after year uh, 2000 practically will use that very similar design guys uh, you can see like when you lock or unlock your car okay this is your door lock actuator that will lock unlock your door what's the purpose of that door lock actuator it will be installed in the door it will be right here and when you close the door it will keep your door closed also you will have uh, two separate places where that's the interior door handle cable attaches so when you open the door from the inside it will pull that lever and it will open the door this is for the outside door handle when you pull the outside door handle it will open the door as well the purpose of that actuator also is to lock <coughs> and unlock your vehicle guys <coughs> so so now uh, also it locks and unlocks your vehicle now when they first start going out often guys not always but very often we hear here at the shop you start hearing a strange noise when you lock or unlock your vehicle we're going to connect the cable now and i'm going to go unlock the car and you will see guys what will happen okay every time you lock unlock okay you see what happens so let's go in three two one okay and check this thing out that noise guys right there that's a bad door lock actuator so that door lock actuator is failing what it does it has a plastic gear inside that either cracks and it starts skipping or the teeth get worn and it starts skipping as well when you hear that noise you gotta make sure your door is locked because you may think you lock the vehicle but actually it's unlocked you gotta make sure that the door unlocks as well and uh, when they start failing you may have trouble locking unlocking the vehicle you hear that noise very often as well or you may not be able to use the interior door handle to open the door from inside or outside depending on how they fail guys uh, another thing okay you have a micro switch inside that uh, on many cars will detect if the door is guys uh, open and if the door uh, uh, it tells you the vehicle door is open, but it's not. Okay, that's what failed, guys. Hopefully the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching and see you guys next time.